Hello horror fans and welcome once again to the Horror Obese. Today I'm going to give you my opinion on a movie that I finally saw. A movie I wanted to see since it came out. And the movie is Halloween. 2018 Halloween. I gotta say, I love this movie. This movie was great. I loved every moment of it. I mean, just like any other movie, it's got a, it's got its hiccups, but from beginning to the end, it was. I just thought it was an incredible ride. I mean, from when the podcasters went haunting Michael Myers, wanting to know what you know brought him to kill his sister, and then um, uh, kill them five babysitters. You know, and wanting to know why he's was so obsessed with Lois Strode's and then showing in the mask. That just sparked something into Michael Myers. I mean, there's not much I can say about this movie that hasn't already been said from other YouTubers. I just wanted to give my thoughts on it. And I, like, I'm, like I said from the beginning, I loved it. Uh... From in from my favorite Halloween, which is the first one to this one, you know it's right in between. Um, like I said, I love the build up, you know, to the confrontations between Lori Strode and Michael Myers, and you know, although some of the killings were just like random, at least that's the way I saw them. You know, maybe I got I gotta keep looking at more. Right now, I've seen it maybe three times just to really get more feel to it. But, you know, I like the killings and everything. And I like how a uh, Lord Strokes is like so, so prepared, you know, and nobody believes that Michael Myers is coming back to get her. Everybody thinks she's just this loony person that needs help. She's an alcoholic. You know, she lives isolated, but, you know, when and it comes down to to it and they see the reality of it, everything just changes and uh, they look at her at a different light. I mean, the only one that I think uh, really believed in her or maybe just entertained the thought of it was her granddaughter that uh, supported her through, you know, all her tragedies and everything uh, what she had gone through I just thought it was a good movie um, I loved it mm, I'm pretty sure everybody's seen it now you know um, I like the ending uh, how the, uh, the three generation of women you know the grandmother uh, the mother the granddaughter they like all you know, get together to to bring this evil entity that you know for years haunted and uh, haunted them and uh, tore them apart. And uh, watching it just burn, you know, and then it uh, her daughter, Lori Strode's daughter, coming to the realization that they weren't creating like a panic room; it was more like a a cage to keep Michael Myers from escaping his his death, his destiny, his fate, or whatever you want to call it. Uh, like I said, I loved it, and I'll keep watching more. Maybe I'll find more clues, more things here and there. You know, but uh, the new Loomis was also kind of loony, in my opinion. He also wanted to understand, just like the podcasters that um, are journalists as they told Lois Strode when they met her um, what you know what drives him you know what drove him to do what he did they wanted to see the inner uh, Michael Myers and uh, to me I just thought that Michael Myers just thought you know Lois Strode was the one that got away and you know he just wanted to just finish that and anything that had to do with her, you know, and that way maybe he would be at peace. 
uh, or, you know, who knows. But it's a kick-ass movie, it's badass. Like I said, I'm pretty sure by now everybody's seen it. But just in case you haven't seen it, you should check it out. You know, it's an awesome movie. And as always, these are just my opinions. You don't have to take my word for it. You know, pretty sure everybody's got theirs. Uh, this is, I never give reviews, I just give thoughts. If I like the movie, I like the movie, and I just like saying it. And well, I loved Halloween 2018, and you know, that's that. <laughs> um, I hope, um, I hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If, subscribe if you want. Leave a comment if you know if you if you agree with me or if you don't. Uh, and until next time, um, on to the next movie. Thanks for watching.